Level 3, all work, no play. 30 lemmings, we can kill one. This is by Flopsy and DMA, apparently. Really. I don't think DMA helped you out with this one. And why does the fire tile that look so weird? Hmm. Well, clearly, we've got to fence our way up through the top. Nope, got a bomb for higher up. Oh, come on! Actually, that works. Is he gonna die? No, he's not! Hey! Okay, let's, let me think this through. So we're gonna need the basher on the top. Let me do the top part. Clearly, we're going to need the platformers up here. They're not going to be any help down there. Yippee. Beautiful. We still have another bomber? Oh, oh, never mind. Alright, so here's what we're gonna need. We're gonna need a builder to get up there. Oh, I see the problem. We still have another miner, that's weird. That's rather strange that we still have a miner left. Oh, I see, I see. I fell into a trap at the end. Really, what you're supposed to do is that. And now we can get over in just one platformer, which gives us a platformer to spare at the end. Very clever. I love it. Was that Ganon sound from Game Over Return of Ganon? Oh, 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 oh. Very clever. The funny thing is, as I was saying, like, I'm not going to need a platformer for that side. I kind of figured, like, just watch me eat my words. Very well done. That was clever. All right, Flopsy. Good job. Good job. What's the next level? The Mean Green Machine. Oh ho ho! This is definitely a Seblem or a Meg Sebites level. And we got cloners. I love cloners. Another button level, for real. And those are teleporters as well. What am I listening to? Is this supposed to be Eggman? Because this sounds a lot more like that one henchman from Black Cauldron. Yeah, you get it. It's death. <laughs> Is 
So is that a splat pad or an anti-splat pad? That's an anti-splat pad. Okay. Why? Are you supposed to dig all the way for this side? Okay, he will get to that button if he's a glider. Interesting. Okay. That will lead to certain doom. Okay. Oh, that's steel on the wall. That's weird. Wait, that turns you around. That's really dumb. Let's see. Try and formulate how to do this. I feel like I got this first part right. walkers a bit differently. Also, where should I be using my cloner? I'm not really sure about that. Maybe I should use him up here, perhaps?
So that's going to put him down low. Which will let me platform at the bottom. That puts him up at the top. I must say, I'm not a fan of this song. So now they're both stuck at the bottom. So I think I'm going to need to dig and bash at the end. Or dig. I'm going to need to save my last digger for the end. That's a problem. Oh, wait. No, I don't. I can just do the bash trick with the walker. problem. How am I going to hold that massive group back? Unless... Yes, I like the look of that. <laughs> and that's the end of the replay already. Cool. What? What? How? How is that even possible? One, right? Cool. Just one. Oh, what? That is so dumb. That should work. It is stupid that that does not work. It looks like it should. What, that's like one pixel? Hmm, <clears throat> okay, well... I can save a basher by doing this. We don't know what that's going to do, but... Oh. 
That's gotta be literally one pixel too many. If it's actually blocking me out. That's not gonna do anything, does it? Well, nah, I didn't think it would. That'll work. Except now I can't save both the blockers. Is there a way I could save one of my walkers? Can't save it there. I gotta use both my platformers at the bottom. There's like no two ways about that. Definitely gotta save both my diggers for there. That's just that's just gotta be a thing that happens. Hmm. Basher, basher, basher. I feel like that's too wasteful using two bashers there, but Tell me, what is Eggman going through? Bitter divorce? So weird as there's a lot of one way up arrows. Or like that there. Like what the heck is that useful for? Why would you not just have no wall there? Because it's not like you can build over that anyways. If we could get one guy past the exit, we could... Hmm. A single miner at the exit, that... I feel like that could be a very, very smart idea. Basher or minor? Oh, it has to be a minor because Basher is not enough. I definitely like what I did here with the minor. 
Which means that there's both my miners are used up. That's a problem. Hmm. Let me try something different with the Batcher. So this creates a little pixel bump. I don't think one pixel's difference is gonna matter, but just in case it does. I could use the... well... I can't use the platform to get over there, because I need to hit that button. I like the two blocker trap I've got going, though. Definitely think that's the way to go. Which means that miner's the only way I'm getting out. can't even afford to let anybody die either, which is quite surprising. Yeah, that's going into the fire and the flames. Which is weird. We've got quite a few walkers, and we even pick more up. Hypothetically, what would happen if I did this? If only I could dig through that entire fan. That would be lovely. <clears throat> This is, a tr this is a tricky one. There must be some big trick I'm missing. Or even just a little trick that I'm missing. I like it, though. This is this is a cool one. I'm not a big fan of the what, Scrap Brain or Starlight Tile sets, though. Sorry, Flopsy. I am i don't think they're that great. They're a bit... It can be awfully hard to tell what's steel, what's not, what's terrain, what's not. I do like the conveyor belts, though. Hmm. On this level, one-way up arrows might as well be steel. Because we have nothing that can even take it out. One way up arrows. Hmm. Tricky one. We don't even have any climbers either. Maybe we don't use the platformers at the bottom. Well, wait, there's that switch down there. We how you'd have to use both platforms at the bottom. 
That's like, that's just, it's done. You have to use both platformers at the bottom. Okay. Because there's no way to hit that switch and get out of there without using both the platformers. Unless you use one there. Do you have to make a lemon get there, walk, platform, get a minor tunnel back up? Oh no. But that's kind of got to be it, right? Got a mine through there. Hmm. get them to go up in there, though, and bypass that. That's a tricky one as well. I need to stop being so afraid of my walkers, I think. there. Nice. We're gonna need free walkers for the end. Two for that guy, one for the walker that we have to make over there. So I'm already using too many walkers. a tricky one, make no mistake. I really do think I've got that part right. I really think so. You definitely have to use a walker there. So 
Then it's a matter of... Actually, we don't need three walkers. We might only need two walkers. Or, heck, even a basher would work. Hmm. That upward switch, though, that's... Yes! Well, I'm still going to be one more. Well, maybe not. Maybe not. Well, that just makes a cycle. I see. So they're gonna do that. Now they're gonna both hit those buttons. We're gonna get two more walkers, giving us three. I don't let them both go to the exit, but that begs the problem. We would need one walker. We could release that guy with the basher. There's supposed to be a walker up there. We could release him with the basher. Then we could use the walker on that guy, but then we need the other platformer. Unless we could just hit on. Can we just bash through this? Get enough height and... No. Not even close. That does work, though. Hmm. It's so weird because. Uh... That would be, yeah, that's totally splat height. Ugh. Hmm. Those walkers, you just gotta be very careful with how you use them. Huh. <sighs> Definitely both blockers need to be used at the top. Oh, right. Yeah, we should be able to just use the single basher to free the guy. Should. 
Yeah, cool. That just works out perfectly, doesn't it? Hmm, this is, here's the problem. If what I'm doing is correct, which it very easily could not be. We, 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 we'd either need to find a way to seal this with both of the platformers before opening all of that. Maybe we could avoid that button. Yeah, let's try something. What if we mine immediately? And we used both our miners, so we can't even mine down through there anyways. But, hey, on. So then if we had a miner left over, we could mine through that. And then we would have three walkers left. We could use one of our bastards to get rid of that guy. Two of them to free that guy. Got it. I've got it. So he's going to do this. Now he's going to turn around. Oh, this is a tough level, but it's a really good one. So he's going to do that, whoopsie woo. We're going to turn him around. Now up at the top, you are going to start digging. Now you're going to start platforming. Wait for Mr. Always right here. Go down, and then he can dig for the other channel. And now he'll walk through the exit before this guy hits the last button. Now that'll open the gate. He'll have a miner left over to mine for that. Then we bash to free that guy. And turn him around. Holy cow! That is a crazy level, but also amazing. Much tougher than you might expect, but I like it. This is a huge improvement over the Revolution rank. I'm so... Ooh, this is a lot of fun. I didn't even mind spending quite a while on this video. The levels are just that compelling. So, very well done, Flopsy. But that is all the time we have for this episode. So thank you very much for watching. I'm Colorful Artie, as always, and tune in next time. We'll be continuing with more storms. Have a great day, and God bless.